Yo, what's good, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of La Finiquera Podcast. I'm here with your special guest, Miss Lady Pinks, and we also got Miss Beautiful here. Yes, hey. sir. Yes, sir. How you guys doing? Good. How are you? I'm We're good. good. I'm good. We're in a casino. It's a different setup. Right? <laughs> hey, it's Never a, thought it's, about it's that. It's the vibe. Well, today, you guys just kind of like planned this today, right? This is a random this thing, is, yes. but we are here. We're uh-huh. in Tucson, Arizona. We have a lot of love for Arizona, so mm-hmm. we come out here like often. Yeah. Here and there, so it's just like, yeah. We I see you guys come out here a, a lot. <laughs> yeah. Yes. A lot of fans. A lot of fans? Yeah, yeah a lot of fans, a lot of support, a lot of uh, people that have a lot of love for us, so we're out here. I feel like you get a lot of that from here from Tucson, like Arizona? A lot of, a lot of Phoenix, a lot of Tucson, so okay. it's like, yeah. Okay, so you also got some in Phoenix. But in Casa Grande, I mean, mm-hmm. you name it, all over. I've been to Winslow. I mean, mm-hmm. it's just all over Arizona. Okay. Well, like you said, you've done shows here, right? Oh, yeah. Who'd we, you do it with? Uh, Capone? Um, yeah, Capone. Yeah, uh-huh. we, the first time that I ever came out to anywhere in Arizona was uh, here. My first show was in Tucson, I think it was, Tucson. or Phoenix. One, okay. one of those, but in Arizona, yeah. Okay. And then you also make music, correct? I do. But I'm not going to talk about the f- first one because that's just not... What's mm-hmm. wrong with the first but one? But this new one. <laughs> yeah, oh we got this God. new one. The new one? This new one called Super Freak. Super Freak? Super Freak. Tell me yes. a little bit about the song. What's going on in it? Well. It's called Super Freak. It's called Super Freak. Mm-hmm. I'm pretty much talking about myself. Okay. <laughs> Would you consider yourself a super freak? Yes. Mm. <laughs> Subscribe hey. to her OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs> don't I, look at me. You don't do OnlyFans? No, no, no. no. Okay. How's the dynamic with like OnlyFans? I've always had the question. I never met. You have one? Yeah, I should, huh? <laughs> you should. <laughs> I definitely should. Wow. <laughs> so yes. how did both of you get into music? I'll start with you. Um, well, I've been I'm one of the first Chicano rappers, okay. so you know it's and um, you know we're very it's a very small group of females doing music. You know, like it's always been like the mainstream and you yeah. know just other. But I was like, you know what? We have to like mm-hmm. embrace our culture, our cultura. And then I, I used to like listen to like a lot of different artists. You know, like just in general. You know, like all the gangster Were you rap and everything. To back yeah, then? yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, a lot of NWA, NWA, a lot of Easy E, okay. you know, just our, our West Coast gangsta stuff, you know. Okay, well, but you're from LA, right? I'm from I'm from California, yeah. yeah. I'm from I'm from a uh, Los Angeles um, county, county, San Gabriel yeah. Valley. I'm from SGV. Mm-hmm. So shout out to all my valleros and my valleras out there. You know what's up? <laughs> Big SGV in the house. <laughs> but um, yeah, that's where I'm from. Okay, yeah. and then you're also from LA. Yes. So how did you get into music? So. First, I got into modeling. You know, I was doing the lowrider scene okay. and all that stuff. And, you know, I started hooking up with, you know, a lot of artists and stuff like that. And then mm-hmm. I used to rap just to have fun. Mm-hmm. I used to sing just to have fun. Somebody heard me singing one day and they're like, hey, I want to, you should do a song with me. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, okay, I'm down. Okay. And then after that, it was a rap. And then now I'm just like, you know. So it took off to where it's at now? Yeah, and I do a lot of things, though, so. Okay, like what, if you don't mind me asking? So I'm a tattoo artist. <laughs> okay, you're a tattoo artist? Yeah, I'm a tattoo okay. artist. There's a lot of different stuff. Yeah, uh-huh. I'm, I do a lot of stuff. I'm a photographer. I'm a graphic designer. Okay. I do a lot of stuff. Jack of all trades. Yeah. As a matter of, mm-hmm. as a matter of fact, when I first met her, uh-huh. um, I was I had a... I had got booked to do a show out in Denver, Colorado, Denver. at the Roxy, okay. by my homie Dank, who um, also throws a lot of shows. He's an mm-hmm. artist out mm-hmm. there in Colorado. Okay. Shout out to all the Colorado fans out there. Hey. And um, she was going to be on the show. Mm-hmm. You know, she was out there modeling and stuff, and, and she was, we're all on the flyer. And, and as a matter of fact, I think you did the flyer, didn't you? Yeah, I did. And then yeah. that's how we met. Okay. Yeah. So mm-hmm. we met out in Colorado. Oh, from Colorado. Yeah, yeah. I was um, I was uh, head- headlining the show. I was out okay. there, and it's been a minute since I've been out there. So it's mm-hmm. like, so when I went out there, it was pretty dope. And I was like, oh shit, okay, cool. She's doing a, um, she did the flyer, mm-hmm. and I was like, and I also had my um, my homegirl Black Widow, mm-hmm. who was also on the flyer, and there was mm-hmm. other artists, Dank and everybody. So it was pretty cool, yeah. and we met, and ever since we just kind of like kept in touch and been doing stuff together, as far as like you know like. You know, just yeah, yeah. Keep have you guys done in. like any music together as well? We, we haven't. We are about oh, to. You're about to. <laughs> we are gonna. Oh, we okay. are coming. I heard that's. I was about to say because you guys seem pretty really close. It. You know, like yes. you guys have good chemistry and dynamic together. Yes, so. we are definitely coming with it. There's <laughs> all coming up. I heard that super freak that she did. I was like, girl. <laughs> is it different? It's dope though. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. When is that coming out? 
It's coming out soon. I was trying to have it out. I was trying to have it out by February, but you know, it's a little. It's gonna get pushed out a little bit because I have a. I have a few that I want to line up Mm. and just have them come out like every month. Yeah. So as soon as it's finished, yeah, you. I'll I'll be posting it. Okay. Okay. (laughs) I've seen that you've done like, well, I mean, you're linked with Capone. You feel me? So like, who out of the LA side do you feel like inspired you the most, or who do you like working with, like out of that side? Well, when I first started off, I started off, um, I I started off with Capone, uh-huh. and I got signed to him. So okay. you know, I was young, and me and Capone go way back, like from the streets. Like we're both from the mm-hmm. SGV, San Gabriel Valley. So when I started like doing music, it was mm-hmm. it, it's it's a long story. I'm not gonna get into it, yeah. but it's just like we clicked. That's my homie okay. from the SGV. So um, I got signed to him, and mm-hmm. he already had you know he built his empire, high power music, mm-hmm. and I was the first you know first female out of the label oh, okay. and um i put in a lot of work you know i did i did a lot of dropped albums and mm-hmm. stuff like that worked with you know different people on my second album i had like snoop on there busy okay. bone okay. uh magic a bu- bunch of different people mm-hmm. on there but um yeah i've dropped i think i have like maybe eight albums and i featured on all so many other albums mm-hmm. and um done music with a lot of different artists so but I mean, yeah. you've been doing it for a minute, right? I've been doing it for a minute. Mm-hmm. You know, I've, I've uh, been all over throughout the states, city to city, state to state. Um, yeah. I met a lot of fans out there because mm-hmm. I've, I've toured on a tour bus, and I, I was, like, kidding even the smallest cities, like Winslow, like going Winslow, through Arizona, yeah. Safford, like Safford, Arizona. Like small little cities, Like all yeah. the pockets, yeah, through mm-hmm. New Mexico, Colorado, Utah, <clears> you <throat> name it. You know, we even, take, we even took the bus out there in um, Tennessee. Tennessee. In the East Coast, yeah. So we've been all over the place, okay. traveling, you know, and mm-hmm. doing all kinds of stuff, showing love to the gente. Because you know, there's fans everywhere. Yeah. And, and I think the social media has made it grow to what mm-hmm. it is, to where people get connected. Like, look at social media brought us together. Yeah, us together. Exactly. And I really don't do a lot of podcasts, guys. So, like, if I'm right here right now sitting down at Del Sol Casino, <laughs> and homie came out all the way from Phoenix to Tucson, that's love. You know, it, it takes mm-hmm. a lot of uh, a lot of grind. You wanted to go out there, connect with people. So a lot of people just, yeah, we got my homegirl, Drizza, makeup by Drizza, hey. <laughs> Fatima. <laughs> and then we also got, uh, since we're in Tucson, I give out uh, uh, the homie Michael, which is uh, Shag- Shags, Shaggy. He's, OG uh, Shag. OG Shags, true it royalty it images. It so, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, I, I, I'm from California, but I love coming out here uh-huh. um, to Arizona. And mm. here, here we are, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah, like, we be working a lot. That's why, like, I was totally down to come over here for this, you know? Yeah. Because I also Well, thank seen, you for having us. Yeah, yeah, of course. And thank you for your time as well, you know? Like, I didn't, uh, I didn't expect it, but you saw I came ready. Yeah, you, you did. did. Man, we were let me, not expecting Let me tell you guys, okay? We're right here. We're doing our thing. Mm-hmm. And then he popped up. And as, as a matter of fact, I want to give a shout out to uh, Tucson Fools community because yeah, they, they're the ones that connected us. He's mm-hmm. like, hey, man, my boy's going out there. So it's all love. I love the fact that everybody's, you know, uh, connecting and showing love to each other. You know, that's mm-hmm. that's what it's about, you know, showing love to the raza, the gente, all coming together and stuff. Mm-hmm. So, um, you know, he's here right now. And here we are, you know. Yeah, thank you. And yeah, you're welcome. Like I said, thanks for your time. You and know I don't do a lot of podcasts, so I told him, I go, you know what? He yeah, told me. Yeah, she don't. He told yeah. me. She's um, never down. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he you don't he do told too many? me she's not that? down. You don't do like have you ever done any? Yes, yeah, she has. You know what I really don't do a lot. Like mm-hmm. I, I don't I, I recently did one because there was like all kinds of stuff going on. So everybody kinda was hitting me up like, hey, why don't you have the podcast and, uh, yeah. and this and that and blah 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 and I was like, Yeah. I mean I've heard I heard about it. Do you mind if we talk about it or not? I mean, what are you talking about? So what went on in this situation, at least from your perspective? What situation? So is, are we talking about the, is it the Genesis? No, what are you nine? talking about? Ah, uh, there you go. Yeah. He, <laughs> want, yeah. <laughs> he wanted to bring that up. I, I don't, I'm not, you know. Um, mm-hmm. Well, basically, I know that a lot of people were bringing it up because mm-hmm. of the fact that everybody wanted to know about it and stuff like yeah. that. And yeah, it, it, it happened. I mean, it got around, you feel me? So. Yeah. So, I mean, but continue with what you were saying. Well, we're basically, um, it's, a, it's a situation where. Mm-hmm. I really didn't want to talk about it because she got the law enforcement involved. Ooh. Yeah, so oh, okay. um, she wanted me, I guess, pretty much to convict myself so she can go run. Because it's not, you know, she's the type of person that doesn't mm-hmm. play straight. You know, okay. um, basically, you know, mm-hmm. like you know, you want to start, you want to start shit, and then after that, when something happens, you're crying online. Yeah, you're crying online, and then you know, like um, you're making with the public. making up stories, with yeah. the yeah. police fake. report, making up stuff, make, uh-huh. trying to m- pretty much manipulate the situation on on. Uh, 
because I didn't, I didn't, I didn't talk about it. Mm. I didn't talk about it. It happened. It didn't talk about it. Mm. Um, and let me clear something up. Okay, this is something that I okay. haven't really said out anything on podcast on a podcast. Mm-hmm. But for one, no, she did not get jumped. It was uh, on one on one. Okay, she got dropped. Okay. But there's a difference, you uh-huh. know. And um, she had her makeup girl there mm-hmm. that got involved. So this is where she switched it around, saying that she got jumped because my girl, my girl backed me up. It's like saying if we're in a situation mm-hmm. and then my girl's there, and yeah. then if it's a one-on-one, and then all of a sudden the other girl jumps in on the other side, yeah. my homegirl's gonna get my back. Obviously. So I that's mean. not called jumping, you know? Yeah. So, no. uh, yeah. But manipulation, you know, mm-hmm. on the internet, everybody flies on the one-story narrative, and everybody mm-hmm. just goes with it because, like, you know, we're crying online. Right. Oh, I'm a, you know, I'm a <clears throat> civilian. Um, I'm a victim. Like, mm-hmm. come on, don't play gangster and then cry online later. We don't play that shit, you know? Yeah. And then so, involving yeah. law enforcement. Yeah. It's, yeah. Mm-hmm. And then going to, the, you know. And then not only that, but somebody, a a good homie that, you know, just was there. And Mm -hmm. he doesn't want no problems on his set, you know, and stuff like that. So it doesn't, it's it's just that type of situation where everybody kind of like, you know, um, she used her Mm -hmm. social media to manipulate everybody and brainwash everybody so they can come and jump and do the, you know, uh, what is it? Like kind of hate on you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, it's the the one story narrative. But anybody who Mm -hmm. uh, believed that. It's pretty naive for even jumping on a one-story narrative when there's a couple other sides to the story. Everything gets kind of changed around, and that's exactly what yeah. happened there. But other than that, I mean, I'm just like, you know, it happened. Mm-hmm. Um, I kept it quiet. I wasn't the one to announce anything. Uh-huh. You know, it was the other side, so okay. I didn't go online crying like a little bitch. So yeah. that, that's what it is. That part. <laughs> that part. Are you going to talk about it? You know, you that better part. be about it. Yeah. And be yeah, about it. Don't start I'm things with anybody that, you know, mm-hmm. you can't. So what I also wanted to further understand, if it's okay with you, um, what was the initial issue? Okay, so she tried to try to pretty much say that she got jumped over music, uh-huh. but I, being in the music industry, uh-huh. I tried to warn her because I had already had met her, and yeah. I tried to warn her about like, hey, you know, you gotta, I, you know, try to look out for another Chicana, another mm-hmm. female. Hey, you know, be careful with this person because this person has a paperwork and is a pedophile, you know. But she was, I didn't know that she was being um, managed by the person that was distributing that pedophile's music. So she was being, that's her manager. So I was like wondering why is she, you know, I hit her up and she ignored the fact that, mm-hmm. you know, um, she ignored uh-huh. me trying to like tell her anything. She just kind of like, you know, blew me off and right. she didn't give a she didn't give a damn. Yeah. So I was like, all right, now, you know, she's getting a little disrespectful, mm-hmm. whatever, you know. So she started just, you know, she, it's her disrespect, mm-hmm. you know, uh, it was to the point where I'm like, okay, you know, you want to be disrespecting, you right. want to, you know, because uh, she posted a video afterwards when I had told mm-hmm. her about it, you know, exposing the music on there. So she brought it upon herself. Yeah. Do you get okay. what I'm saying? She yeah. leaked the video, like, okay, like kind of mocking me. So I'm like, uh-huh. all right, bitch, I'm not going to talk, you know, I'm not going to bang on you online, but. Uh-huh. Hey, you know, but if we see again, each other, we cross paths, it's a, a different thing. It's on site, you know? Mm-hmm. So, I mean, I'm pretty sure everybody knows. Like, you know, if you have a certain issue with somebody and they disrespect you, and if you run into them, like, you know, don't just talk on the line online. Mm-hmm. You better be able to back that shit up. Show up. Yeah. So if you, you know, mm-hmm. and that's what happened. That's you it. feel like you won it? Huh? <laughs> you feel like you won? It, do I, I feel like I won what? what? Like, you feel like you won the, the little scrap you guys had? There was no there scrap. Was no. Oh, there was no nothing? There was no scrap. Nothing? She came at me. Uh-huh. And, and she, she got, got dropped. <laughs> that was it? <laughs> that yeah. was it. One second it. Up, one Captain second Save down. a Ho came in. Captain Save a Ho came in. <laughs> and that's when, that's when, um, that's another thing, too, though, like, you know, pretty much um, when her friend got involved, that's when my friends, ah, uh-uh, uh-uh, yeah. let them, it was that, you know? Ah, okay. And then it wasn't actually a fair. If you wanted to talk about jumped, then the guy got involved yeah. and pushed me. Oh, okay. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. So if you really want to talk about jumping, there was three on two. Because mm. including you know? that guy. Yeah, he yeah. pushed me. He pushed me. Oh, and then, okay. And then there's another thing, too, okay? So I guess that guy, the Captain save a uh-huh. um, basically <laughs> said <laughs> that he jumped on her because he tried to save her. Uh-huh. And, you know, um, you know, I tried to back her up. I, I jumped mm. on her so they wouldn't be hitting her. Yeah. And da, da, da. No, nah, fool, you got pushed and he fell on top of her and you ran with that story. Like, basically, he tried to, like, he he, he got pushed because he pushed me, mm-hmm. you know, by one of the guys that was there. Like, nah, hey, yeah. what, are you, what is the Why guy doing and yeah. getting involved in girl business, you mm-hmm. know? 
So when he, he got pushed, he fell on top of her. Mm. And so it wasn't like, okay, you know, he, he tried to save her. Yeah. <laughs> he fell on top of her and ran with the story. Oh, man. Okay. Yeah. So and then he, you know, he tried to do the whole cape thing. So yeah, yeah. Save that's hope. funny. Yep. That's so funny. So, um, yeah. So, so guys, if there's um, any guy, girl scuffles or anything like that, don't get involved. That's weird. Weird. Yeah, it's between y'all. You feel me? There's yeah. No and then to go online and even talk about it and about it. Like, hey, I know I was there. Mm. Like, God damn. Pinche metiches. Met yes. yeah. Metiches. And not only that, like, dude. I wouldn't want him to be in, in, uh, like around her or him or any of those type of people be around a real situation because those are the ones that are going to be talking yeah. and squealing real quick. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't know. Constant stuff, gangster and stuff like that, whatever. Yeah. He should be going by the rules, you know, them to be getting in yeah. a girl's business. But that's it pretty much. You know, I don't know. Pretty much kind of. That's pretty much that situation. Pretty yeah. much. Okay. <laughs> 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 uh, well, I'm going to divert a little bit from it. I'm How tall are you? Like five? Five, six and five, a half. Six? Yeah. We so full size, not fun yeah, size. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you get the whole with us. The whole package. <laughs> so what are you guys' like, next moves that you guys coming out? Like what's? Like as far as what? Let's, well, let's she start has off her single that's going to be dropping. Music, yeah. um, I'm going to be, you know, making music and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And then, um, yeah, we, we're talking about doing something together. Yes. Mm -hmm. We're also t talking about doing shows, like, okay. um, mm -hmm. yeah, upcoming shows and stuff like that. So mm -hmm. moving yeah. around the mm -hmm. world. Going around the world. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and I want to drop, like, more visuals. Um, I got a few tracks that I, like, songs that I want to put out and do visuals for because I really, um, I have my YouTube channel. I've always been under the labels. Mm -hmm. So I started kind of, like, um, building my own channel i'm not so she's she, she like you said she knows how to do like all this stuff but i'm not so computer savvy so i always have something somebody else do it yeah. for me but i was like okay you know i'm gonna um mm -hmm. I, I have my own channel now so it's mm -hmm. just basically the the pinky rose on youtube um okay. i'm building my channel and i'm getting like my, all my new music on there mm -hmm. um and that's that's basically it. I want to drop more more mm. visuals. I agree An with album like, out. Yeah. I agree with dropping visuals. Everybody just wants to see something. Nobody just wants to hear, hear it. Hear it. Yeah. Yeah. You know, like I want to. Yes. Entertain my eyes with something. Yeah. Like, True. You know? So I, that's why I think short form content like TikTok has really like progressed everything forward. But also everybody has an attention span that's like five seconds. True. Everybody's scrolling so fast. Unless you unless you're shaking ass in the music video, they're not exactly. gonna watch the then whole video. Then I'll watch video. the full thirty seconds. <laughs> like me. <laughs> Yeah, hey. but then I'll rewind it. Let me rewind <laughs> it a little bit more. Okay. But yeah, like everybody's just like after five seconds, if it just doesn't hook in the first five seconds, they're just scrolling. That's why past you gotta it. have that ass shot right there in the thumbnail. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> you feel like yeah, the no, Odyssey. You're you know right. what? I I, yes. can't, I can't really have, I can't really sometimes have that and have that as a thumbnail. How she said it. Mm -hmm. Well, on YouTube. I think it's different, but YouTube is different. Yeah, because yeah. When I remember putting something like a um, a promo video that I did on my um, mm -hmm. on my on my Instagram, mm -hmm. and it was actually one of my girls' ass shots. Well, the next thing you know, um, mm -hmm. yeah, I couldn't it. upload it. They they took it down. Yeah, the Instagram is very very sensitive and stuff like that. Yeah, so a little was bit, it Instagram yeah, or YouTube? Instagram. 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 Yeah, YouTube. I don't okay. think I've had any problems yet. I get shadow banned all the time. And I can't go live. And <laughs> really? And I'm trying to. And I yeah. can't. I, when I do go live, it doesn't show my live to a lot of people. Like mm -hmm. it shows it to very little people. So it's like, yes, it's very sensitive. Yeah. Instagram. Ah, uh, okay. From the from the girl side, do you, have you guys ever experienced any hate towards you guys? All from the other time. People? Yes. Other females, yeah. All the time. Like what? Like what do you mean? <laughs> Haters. They just. Just on the internet. Yeah. On never the internet, person. Never yeah. in person. Just never no. person. on the internet. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, I mean, if they if they seen you in person, it's a whole different story. When they're on the internet and they're safe behind a fake account, mm -hmm. then they're talking the Everybody most. They're saying everything, off, yeah. and it's like you know what, mm. you ain't about nothing. You know what mm. I mean? I had an incident where there was a a, a girl or a guy, I don't know what it was, and mm. they were like saying a bunch of stuff that they knew where I lived. They were gonna show up at my house, and I was like, show up, show up. Mm -hmm. Pull and up. You know where I live? Pull the. F up. Yeah. Matter. I'm like, pull the fuck up, bitch. Yeah. She's like, oh, I know where you live and I'll be over there. And then there, she's like, well, I'll roll by your house just so you can know who I am. But I'm not going to get out because I had my hair what and my nails up? done. Like, what just pass by and Yeah, just pass wait? by and <laughs> yeah. say hi. No, bitch, get oh, off. We going in my, my backyard. God. Yeah. That's, that's what you and call it. That's a, what I said to a her. A drive by. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she did a quick drive by. <laughs> Trying to do a drive by on me. And I'm like, mm, no, get off the car. No cops involved. Mm -hmm. You want something? Come over here and we yeah. can get it. And I think that's a problem today is like, honestly, today is like, I think I feel like everything's so different. Like people are so different, built different mm -hmm. than how 
we were back in the days yeah. because we still have hold cold. Okay. You know, we still have cold and and and, and live by it. Do you get yeah. what I'm saying? Versus like people that just bang online and then when you see them something happens and the next thing you know it's like they're quick with their 911 fingers. Yeah, it's just bitch it's up. like don't talk about it if you're yeah. not going to be about it. Exactly. I mean, you know, it's like definitely changed from what it was to what it's at now. Ugh. You know Annoying. What I'm saying? A yeah. lot of the people, like, I mean, you could even say for certain rappers, like, they don't really follow the same codes. No, I've, I've seen that a lot. I see, I've seen you that a lot. That's why, like, that's why it's like, uh, honestly, I'm not scared to do, like, I'm, I'm not scared. And obviously, everybody knows that because there's history of it. Mm. <sighs> but they're not, I'm not scared to, like, get down with anyone or do anything mm. like that. I'm scared of what they're going to do. I'm not, I can't say I'm scared. I'm just, just, you got a lot to lose. It, it's mm. just, it's just, different now like it's scary to know that people are not going to be like you get in a scuffle and then and it's boom boom it's over with and that's it yeah people want to go like oh you know what um I, I, you know I, next thing you know you're getting handcuffed mm -hmm. yeah do you get him it's like that why make it a big deal like you know like yeah. how we we're just talking about like a simple fight it's a girl fight this type of stuff happens all the time in the hoods and yeah. ain't nobody reporting nothing or nobody's going straight to the cops and stuff like that well another problem is like everybody's shooting now you feel me like nobody's just gonna <laughs> scrap it out even after they lose like i mean they've been on that they've been on that yeah. they've been on that, they've yeah. been on that. And, you know and it's and it just people it just are talking people are even rapping about doing stuff they never done selling drugs like bitch you ain't never sold no drugs in your life <laughs> Karen. But don't be don't be <laughs> rapping about shit you ain't never done because mm -hmm. you look like a damn fool, an idiot. Everybody just faking that shit. I, and there's gonna be silly. a lot of people that are gonna be sensitive to mm -hmm. this. <laughs> I'm just saying. Look at the homegirl Jessa right here. Up, she's from the tech. Hey. She she, know, she knows about haters. Where are all, hey. yeah, fuck all these haters out here. Shit. <laughs> Say it on the mic. Shit. Fuck all these haters out here. <laughs> Fuck them all. On the internet, on the internet. And there's going to be a lot Post of haters on this shit right yeah, now. About shit. <laughs> oh, well. Shit. And you know what's funny? Because, like, you know, like, um, we're just talking, we're having this conversation about, like, the most, the majority of the time. Mm -hmm. It's like all these hate, all this hate and all these comments, hate comments and all this shade that's being, then you click on our profile and it's like, wait, this is a fake page. <laughs> yeah. Like, you know, and people it's do like that shit all the time. They make fake the pages time. just to say something you know so they don't scared. say it directly. Exactly. That's how you know they're scared when they have to hide behind a fake page. Sure. A profile. Just a comment. Like, comment with your I, real page. Not only that, they go and make fake pages and then follow everybody that, that you follow. You, yep. shit. Yeah. That's crazy. And people would like, be doing no, too, much. Yeah. too much. Yeah. That's way too much. Like too much. Too much. And then they want to go do it. Exactly. Like, they try to beat you to the punch and they're like, oh, it's don't be mad. But it's like, bitch, like, stay in your lane and we'll stay in ours, you know? I've had someone like make that. a fake account just to message me some hate yeah, shit, and yeah. then like, I ended up finding out it was actually the <laughs> B-phobia. Yeah, say it with so, your chest, little bitch. Right. Just, Do say know. that again. Say it with your chest, little bitch. <laughs> uh, there so it I wanted, is. That I also part. wanted to ask both of you guys, at least from the California scene, what do you guys think about like lefty gunplay? He's he's young. Oh. He's from um, SGV. He's, mm -hmm. he's uh, coming up. and I mean, I never met the dude, but yeah. You never met him? No, nah, I never met him. Uh, what do you think about his music? Um, I've, I've, he sent me a couple of his songs when he first uh -huh. started off. Like, yeah, I know. Well, mm -hmm. I'm going to say he first started off. I think not so long ago. He sent me, he introduced himself to me on a DM. Okay. And then, um, you know, he just uh, sent me some of his music. And I was like, all right, cool, okay. cool, cool. And then that was and it. And who else comes out of there? Is it Peso and Rowdy? Um, Peso, I think I seen on one of the social medias. I never met him. I really never don't really, I never really heard his music. Okay. I think one of my homies, um, uh, Boxer Loco, I think he did a song with him. He has him okay. on the song. That's how I knew somewhat. But I, mm -hmm. I just seen on one of the pages or something. I, he just okay. got out or something. But yeah, Rowdy, he's also um, another guy from our area, mm -hmm. um, from SGV, and he's okay. he's doing a thing too. Yeah. Okay. Those are like uh, the younger ones, you know. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. I think everybody that's doing music right now, it's like it, they're just popping off and doing their thing and keep doing your thing. You know, I'm yeah. not. It, we we ain't hating on nobody. And enough nope. like people are saying like. You know, uh, oh, she's just hating on her, like, you know, and stuff mm -hmm. like that. There's no hate. I, my girls are beautiful, and she could tell you, look at her too. Mm -hmm. You know, has I have I ever been a hater? No, she is I'm not a hater. Not a hater not with at any all. females. When Anybody? I heard that, I thought it was so ridiculous. Because you know what? I'm not. <laughs> that girl is not. She's cute and everything, but I'm not saying anything. I'm not saying. Oh, I'm not a hater at all. But I, she has way prettier homegirls. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like way prettier homegirls mm -hmm. with bomb ass bodies and. Huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. But, uh, he can vouch for that. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, I got some, like, yeah. So yeah, She has nothing but bomb-ass homegirls. Like, yeah. so that that is, like, already, that's, 
that's like discredited. And uh -huh. it's funny because they were like even saying like, girl, you're like the least one to be like catered towards any females, you know? So for anybody to say that's just a smut, you know, just something to say. Yeah. Yeah. I agree with that. But other than that, like, you know, like I said, you know, like I, I um, you know, I w I'm cool with everybody. I've mm -hmm. been cool with everybody. Unless there's something wrong with them, then it's just a whole different get down, yeah, you know, like, different. you know, yeah, but. But other than that, I'm, I'm for the gente, I'm for the raza, I'm for the culture, I'm from like everything, mm -hmm. you know, like. I feel like I'm we're starting to see everybody. a lot more like uh, rappers with like Mexican culture in there. You feel me? I feel like that's on the come up at the moment. Yeah. Where I feel like rap kind of took like a, a sidestep, you feel me? Because we went from, I'd say, whatever Pitbull era was, we went from Pitbull to like rap for a little bit, hip hop. And then we transitioned over like Calvin Karras for a bit, I'd say. And then we really hit like the little pumps. You know, that little type of era, the little rap wave. Little pump. And we went from reggaeton, which mm. was like a I don't like switch. reggaeton. She doesn't like, reggaeton, like reggaeton, reggaeton. But I like reggaeton. <laughs> Why not? It just I like annoying. to twerk. Mm. No, she, she likes to twerk with anything. <laughs> 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 I just feel like... Is that uh, facts? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, if I could get down to it, I will. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yes. Just give her a couple of drinks and she'll be on top of the table. Like, hey. <laughs> I'm get you a couple of drinks right <laughs> now. Drop the money, bitch. <laughs> no, but... Um, other make than it that, rain. Yeah, make it rain. There you go. <laughs> but I, I just don't like it. Mm -hmm. I, I think it's like it sounds like the same beat. Dun, 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 dun. And it's just so fucking annoying. Yeah. I like it's it. It's like an in and mm. this you don't like one. Your, you don't like your bad bunnies or like I don't like any of that. I like it. I don't like any of that. It's annoying. I think if it was on a different type of beat, like, you uh -huh. know, like if it didn't have that little same sound, mm -hmm. then it'd be different, but it's annoying. And what especially you, if I go to a Mexican restaurant, uh -huh. I want to hear some Mexican you hear some reggaeton. Yeah, music. You don't I don't want to hear that. At the I, I'm not Mexican restaurant, they do play Mexican music. Yeah, well, shit, keep it real. You yeah. know, it's like, why are you going to go with this I other agree shit? with that. that yeah, part. it's yes. like, it's, mm -hmm. it's like I if agree. I go to like a Japanese. Makes me want to eat Mexican food. Like, I feel like I'm yeah, in the ambiance. Yeah, but it's like if I go to a Japanese restaurant, you know, like if I go, we, if I'm going to go eat Japanese. And we start hearing like. Other, and I want to hear Japanese like yes. sounds, like calm. Yeah. yeah. Like going to like, you know. Maybe you go to a Japanese restaurant, they're playing corridos. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay, that's the like, cook in the I? back. No, that's, that's what's cooking that's in the back. That's the homie in the back cooking, <laughs> throwing some corridos. I'm like, hey. Mm -hmm. No, but other than that, mm -hmm. yeah. It's, okay. I want to feel the vibe. If I'm going to mm -hmm. eat some. Chilaquiles or some carne asada, some palitos. I want to hear some chente or some, some oh, you yes, know, yes. yes, you know, Jenny that Rivera part. or, Chalino. you know, some, yeah, chal Chalino, mm -hmm. man. You know, so it's like, you yeah. know, I'm not, if I'm going to go eat something else, mm -hmm. like um, if I'm in Miami or if I want to eat some Cuban food or, you know, some something Puerto Rican food, then, then I, I get the whole thing. But yeah. it's like when I go to a Mexican restaurant, so to all the Mexican restaurants out there, all the tacos, Taquerias, and you know, please, if you see me step in, change the freaking playlist. <laughs> porque, uh, uh, I actually tell them, ask him to. Mm -hmm. Oh, you really do? Oh, yeah, I do. I'm, like, yeah. hey, uh, I'm trying to eat it. Please, can you change, change it? They do. Oh, all right. They're not usually like pretty pent up about it or nothing? No, uh, no I mean, if you're going to step into a place and drop some money and order all kinds of stuff, and, you yeah. know, they're going to make it comfortable. Right. I want to <laughs> eat comfortable. I don't want to be a dun 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 dun. I'm like, Okay, let's take it a go. You don't yeah. want to shake her. She's butt. gonna be, she's gonna be partying oh, yeah. over here. I'm gonna but. be like, hey. <laughs> but other than that, um, I think. <laughs> other than that, I think it's mm -hmm. like, you know, it's 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 pretty. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. And like pretty much, words. pretty much. Right <laughs> but yeah. Well, I feel like now, like Mexico's finally getting the representation worldwide, especially with, with Peso like Peso Pluma, Pluma hitting. You know what I'm saying? Right. We have corridos tumbados and stuff like that. And that's like kind of the trend right now. Mm -hmm. I feel like Mexico's finally on the come up, you know? And it's cool to see that translating into rap too. Yeah, you know? the, the, trap, the trap corridos yeah, and all that. Yeah, the trap corridos and yeah. all that shit. And then even the rappers from Mexico, they killed Lefty SM. Um, you remember, Le you know? Lefty, as a matter of fact, um, uh, Mr. Capone has a song with him. He does? Yeah, he has a song with Lefty. It says, it's called that's Soy crazy. Cholo. You guys got to check it out. It's pretty dope. Okay. I'll have yeah. to check that out right well, now. You know what? And I think he has the video. He hasn't dropped it yet. Oh, damn. And I know when he drops, it's going to yeah. be major because he's not here anymore. You well, know, rest in here. peace to yeah. Lefty, you know, and, and uh, the Santa Fe clan. Santa Fe is fire. Yeah. You know, that mm -hmm. that's I, I uh, follow one of the guys and uh, mm -hmm. we follow each other. Uh, okay. But, yeah, it's pretty cool. Other than that, um, I see a lot of rappers coming up from Mexico, too. So, yeah, yeah. Exactly. I wouldn't mind collabing with some of them, you know. Mm -hmm. So maybe in the near future and stuff. Yeah, do a yeah. show in Mexico. You know what? I haven't done any shows in Mexico. Mm -hmm. I go out to Guadalajara porque, like, mm -hmm. my mom's from Guadalajara. Uh -huh. um, I recently lost my grandmother. She's from out there. Oh, I'm sorry to hear um, that. We have, uh, you know, we have our property out there and stuff mm -hmm. and, and uh, my family. Okay. So, yeah. And I, I love Guadalajara. You Guadalajara. Know, I just, that's, that's probably where you would do it at? 
That's where you would you want to. You know what? There, and there's a lot of rappers from Guadalajara. Really? I think Lefty wasn't from there too, no? His family's from there? No, uh, Lefty. Wasn't oh, he from Lefty? there too? I think so. I, I know he, he got popped in um, San Luis. Oh, okay, San Luis, yeah. I think it was San Luis. I've I might be there. wrong. Isn't you it might right be here? right. Yeah. San Luis. Yeah, San Luis, Rio Corral. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've been there not so long ago. Yeah. Yeah. So I, I know that's where he unfortunately passed away, you know, but yeah. I'm not too sure. You mm. might be right. He might be from Guadalajara. I'm not sure, but yeah. So um, to kind of end it off as well, is there okay. anything you guys want to let your either your fans know or any um, final message? You know what? I just want to give a shout out to the fans because mm -hmm. they've been down and for those for new ones and old ones, mm -hmm. because the, the ones that been following me for a long time have followed my journey. And I really appreciate them, you know, mm -hmm. um, still banging with me today, hey. following up. Mm -hmm. And not only that, but the like, real ones. yeah, the and real don't ones. get easily manipulated by hate bandwagons and just be like, they know you're they know me. So they know when they hear something, like, ah, you know? Yeah. But shout out to all the fans. Um, mm -hmm. Not only that, without them, we wouldn't be here mm -hmm. and doing things. And, and just to all the new followers, to all the new followers, thank you guys. Um, and then make sure you guys follow Miss Beautiful, okay? Hey. She's uh, been in the game for a minute. Hello. Hello. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, yeah, she has this um, dope ass track, the Super Freak, yep. you know? So make sure you guys follow her, mm -hmm. um, her social media. Uh, my social media for the new ones that are watching here. Um, my Instagram is at Miss Lady Pink. Uh, Miss, I'm sorry, my bad. <laughs> at Pinky Rose. Um, you can also shop at my store, which is uh, PinkyRose.com. I'm also on TikTok, which is also okay. Pinky Rose. YouTube, Pinky Rose, mm -hmm. Miss Lady Pink. So just pop in. Um, I have blue checks, so I'm ver uh, verified. Mm -hmm. So you'll know which one's the right page. Because if you put okay. Miss Lady Pinks, but I'm Miss Lady Pinks. Mm -hmm. um, and yeah, so and then she has her social media and then your social and her only my fans. social media. <laughs> my social media is Miss Beautiful. And, and the reason why I have to do the underscores because I got my last page got shut down because I was doing too much. Remember, we were talking about that. Mm -hmm. So that was Miss Beautiful. <laughs> she got reprehended. Underscore one, three, one, three, underscore. <laughs> OK, I'm going to have my camera guys spell that out. Okay. Yes, camera. <laughs> do that. Yeah, Miss yeah. Beautiful underscore 1313 underscore and okay. on facebook i think it's the same thing it's um, pinky rose 100 pinky or rose. pinky rose or miss lady pink yeah you, you guys will see it I'm yeah, verified. we're both verified so you'll find oh, it oh yeah you are now shout outs to la F finiquera podcast this was so random we're not even dressed as you can tell we're, we're just mm -hmm. humbly on here they popped in from phoenix arizona we're in tucson arizona shout outs to everybody out in arizona to everybody out throughout the states, everybody that's watching, that's you know, they're pretty sure it's gonna get around. This is gonna get around, and everything yeah. that I said here was true. So don't try to you know come back and say that's not true. Yeah, Biatch, please. <laughs> but uh, we're here. Shout out to everybody here. Shout out to the camera guy. Uh, what's my boy's name is Gio. Gio, G G G Gio. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and everybody Gio. here that's Gio. here with us right now, <laughs> you know, True hey. Royalty Images. Uh, my whole girl makeup uh, by. Yeah, yeah, I know, but where'd she go? <laughs> Where'd she, she go? I, she was I didn't even notice Make her. Make it by Drizza. I'm going to go, go, go Fatima in the house. Just disappeared. And hey. her primo. Say, what's up, primo? Come on through. See, we, we, got, we got the gunner in the house. Ah, ah. <laughs> we, we got the homie right here doing the security and just in case anybody comes to the trip. Blah, blah, blah. Ah. Ah. Just in case they try to say no, we, we jump people. Ah. Ah. Shit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, man, we had a... We had we had a we had a fan that came through earlier because we did a little uh -huh. quick little thing pop up, and it was funny because uh well, no wait a minute, wasn't it I, wait? Oh. It was a, <laughs> I called him Capone. I thought it was the other the it girl. Was, you, you know I thought it was wait wait it was Drizzle's cousins. I was, at him, I was like, no Capone. because it's not Capone. <laughs> yeah you thought it was Capone. Yeah, no I because at him, I was like huh. Yeah you know as a matter of fact he he thought he thought he was Capone, and it was like it was funny because um. I mm -hmm. confused him with the guys that were uh, here with Drizza. I think those two guys that came. Yeah, uh -huh. any other, yeah. so it was two and two. I, my bad. We just ran zone. <laughs> and I haven't even drank. <laughs> Not yet. Not yet. Not yet because we bought a drink. Oh, yeah. And gamble. Yeah, yeah, all that. We're definitely down to share a drink with you guys if you guys are down. Hey. Oh, yeah, we're down. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, like I said, I appreciate you guys coming on, and I appreciate all the time. You know, like I said, it was random. And yeah, so yeah, yeah. Random. More out of that, like but I appreciate we're so you guys so random. much. That's just, yes. this. Everything was so random mm -hmm. today. We decided, oh, let's do this. You know what I mean? Okay. Okay. Everything was random. Random. Yep. Yeah, I mean that's how we do it. But it worked out perfectly. It right? did. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know the connection, everything, the vibes. They're all here and stuff. You know, with everybody and 
It's all good. And then I want to give a shout out to my baby daddy, who's uh, who's babysitting our three-year-old. So it's like I'm here right now. <laughs> nice. Shout out to the baby daddy. Nice. Shout out to the my baby daddy. Taking care of the kids right now. Yeah. It's his shout turn. Out to whips for days. <laughs> yeah, it's his turn today. The what? I said it's his it's, turn today. Yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> he's just a good dad. He's, he's a good dad. Very, just very be good doing dad. a lot. Yeah. Nice. Mm -hmm. Love to see that. Yeah. He's the definition of what you want. Your and a man. Be like, yeah. man, your man. I yes. I looked out because like he's he's an amazing dude. Okay. Yeah. That's my vato. Your baby daddy cool? <laughs> we ain't gonna talk about it. She said next, next. No, you know what? I got. We ain't gonna talk about it. You gonna talk about it? <laughs> hey, hey! I said I'm gonna talk about it, and I talked about it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to talk about none. Then, yeah, we and ain't that's talk without about the it. drinks. I, I, I don't. I don't well, need it. Well, my a, baby dad is actually in prison right now. He's so. incarcerated. Oh. She's gonna go see him tomorrow. <laughs> Oh, don't I have to just say that? Well. Just say it. <laughs> Bitch, I said it for you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hell no. Oh, God. Well, like I said, I appreciate just plain. you guys coming out with me. Can you stop and, that? 